And so it comes to pass. <laughs> Ages after the twin vessels were forged, a new soul appears. This is... Brave soul. One day you will stand before two baboons. One day you will rend what? the very fabric that binds this land. But until that day comes, you must toot. What? Toot your trombone, brave soul, and you may yet become the trombone. What the Jack. fuck is this? What? The, why is Mozart here? What is happening? <laughs> okay. I guess, I mean, I guess we just start with play, huh? Oh, God. I guess we'll just go with... Jubilant. Sorry, these are so baffling to me. I like Hornlord as a name, so we're gonna go with that. Why did they describe the musant as succulent? I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Oh, wait, oh, God. Hold on, I need to fuck with the uh, settings. Oh god, there is what? Okay, we're we're getting back to that. The succulence of a trombone. Yeah, I need to unreverse it. Hold on. Okay. Settings. Oh, yeah, let's also just bring our uh, master volume down to like 85. <coughs> Baboon quantity normal. Sure, whatever. I, sure. Oh, God. I'm just having band flashbacks now. There's fucking air horn. I deserved an A for that. <laughs> but you know what? I earned 281 toots. Okay. There are between two and four spiders living inside the average trombone. Oh god!
truly succulent. I've never heard that part of the song. <laughs> I have chat as an overlay so it comes up on the game. Getting the, like, pitch right, I think, is the hardest part. Because then I'm getting the pitch wrong, and then I'm like, oh god, and I, like, let the note go, and then my note's also wrong. <laughs> okay, I have 236 more toots. Okay. Oh, this one has horse sound effects. We have to play it. First trombone was in a 20 million- that feels like a lie. Sorry, the, the horse is so distracting. Listen, I was in band, I would fully believe there are spiders living in trombones. God. Why are there so many horses? Every time I'm like, it has to be over, right? It just keeps going and there's more horses. <gasps> oh, God. I didn't deserve a B. I didn't. I mean, yeah, but I didn't expect that many horses. <clears throat> we have 253 more toots. What are toots for? Why are we earning toots? Trap drums, Mozart would have approved. Mozart would approve. If you placed all the trombones on earth end to end, they would wrap around. <laughs> oh god. No. Good for him. Looks hard. Oh, 
He, he sure is. <coughs> you know, at least I've gotten at least a B on everything. <laughs> Regret signing up for a solo at state. It, yeah, that's true. That feels correct. What are the toots for? Why are we earning toots? Surely this one. More trombones on Earth than there are humans. Now, I don't believe that one. Couldn't tell you why. I lost it. Pico, can you stop causing problems? <laughs> I got Ness! And I got 361 toots and an achievement. Okay, so I have toots now. Your collection. Play the main game to earn toots. Spend them on tromboner cards. Can you collect all 50? Probably not. Is this gotcha? That's so funny. Oh my god, it's trombone gotcha. God, it's trombone gotcha. Indianapolis-born J.J. Johnson was one of the most influential jazz trombonists of all time, credited with demonstrating that the trombone could be played in a fast bebop style. He could eat ten hot dogs in one sitting. Good for him. Sergei Prokofiev, Russian-Soviet pianist and composer, composed masterpieces across multiple musical genres. He infamously consumed hot dogs backwards. I'm just not even going to think about that one. Trombacha. <laughs> Al Gray, American jazz trombonist who, was played with Count ba who played with Count Basie, was known for his plunger mute technique and literally wrote a book on plunger techniques. As an American, he probably ate a ton of hot dogs. What's with the hot dogs? Favorite clef of the primordial baboon toot seeker Tom. This clef represents light, but there can be no light without dark. I don't think I like that. Okay. Roswell Rudd, legendary tromboner and composer who worked in free and avant garde jazz, taught ethnomusicology performed with Malian and Mongolian musicians, and could eat 900 hot dogs per nanosecond. You know, I gotta say I don't believe that one. <coughs> don't know why. Glenn Miller, this trombonist and band leader, extremely popular in the 1940s, died while flying to France to entertain U.S. troops during World War II. His aircraft disappeared over at English Channel during bad weather, and somehow that has nothing to do with hot dogs. And that's almost more confusing. Oh, we got Al Gray again. Okay. Mouthpiece. This is where it all begins. The part of the trombone where your mouth goes. Don't put your mouth on the other parts. Without this, you got nothing. If you ever see a mouthpiece in real life, try blowing air into it. 
I like the implication of just coming across random mouthpieces. Okay. What's baboon? Okay. Baboon facts. Big brain scholar. There are only six species of baboons. Despite appearing in trombone champ, mandrills are not technically baboons. Baboons have been around for over two million years. Baboons are omnivorous, which means they can eat anything. They could probably eat hot dogs, although we would not re recommend trying to feed a baboon hot dogs. Why hot dogs? Baboons can live up to 30 years in the wild and up to around 45 in captivity. There's a species of baboon called the kind of baboon, which is funny because it's definitely a baboon. A group of baboons is called a troop. I don't know the difference. I'm so Highest note playable on trombones is so high pitched that only something. Okay. Pats, okay. That's a piccolo, my good bitch. I just had like war flashbacks to being in jazz band and having to do solos. I need to know that while I'm trying to do this, he goes actively, like, fucking with my chair. Hey, you can feel hunger. It's okay. You're not gonna die. Thank you. Thank you for the... <laughs> the bits there. Happy birthday. Oh, this sounds terrifying. Oh dear. World record for most trombones owned is held by Mike Brass. Oh my god, I can't read that fast. Oh god, there's balloons. Oh 
Nikki, this is not the time. Pfft, honey. Oh my goodness. She's doing the full paw stretch up. To beg. <sighs> Takes over 3,000 tons of brass to produce a single trombone. That also... <coughs> my apologies. Oh my god. I just like it's the bi colors. Happy Pride. I'm just impressed he got good at a song. <laughs> I don't know if the incredibly pathetic Hiko noises are coming out. And now a rainbow. It really is happy pride. Fucking Mars? Cool. I love reliving middle school trauma. In real life, there are over nine songs that feature a trombone. That's true, actually. That's very true. Oh, God. I do love the song. I just associate this part of the song with uh, fucking dissociating because I was a flute player. Yeah, I'm like, I'm a fucking woodwind. I just let the trombones do their shit. Oh my god. My high school band director was a uh, professional trombonist. Like, was on call for multiple jazz groups and orchestras. I've never been more glad I was a woodwind. <laughs> I'm 
I don't know if any of the cat noises are coming to. Oh yeah, that's awesome. Okay, so I have very specific story about this part of the song. And it's that we had a regionals competition at one point. And I accidentally played one note in between those, like, during the pauses. <laughs> one singular note. But I was on saxophone at that point, so you could hear it. Also, because the whole rest of the orchestra was fucking silent, obviously. Go spend our toots. We don't have any turds. What are turds? Bro, I could not tell you. I'm gonna be real. I don't know. Design your own. It's intentionally enough blanks so you can design your own. J. Strauss II is an Austrian-born composer, wrote over 500 pieces, and is credited with popularizing the waltz in 19th century Vienna. Sadly, his baboon-like facial hair prevented him from eating hot dogs. Which definitely existed in the 1800s. Tra <laughs> immortal guardian spirit tasked with preserving the order of the base and treble clefts as a guardian spirit unable to eat hot dogs but imbued with the power of at least 10 1791 to infinity Sergei Prokofiev oh we already got him before and there's also trombone gotcha J.S. Bach, Johann Savan Sebastian Bach, is, a widely, is widely considered one of the most influential composers of all time, partially due to his Baroque compositions, but mostly because he invented the hot dog. I can't say I think that's true. Which we've gotten Prokofiev so many times. Music is what we call the sounds made by trombones. It's like hot dogs for your ears. What's with the fucking hot dogs, man? It sounds really good, except for when it sounds bad. Try to find music you enjoy and then listen to it a lot. Tromboner cards. The tromboner card, tromboner card. Collectible cards featuring famous tromboners, legendary composers, and all sorts of incredible things. Everybody loves these cards. Collect them all or suffer the tragic consequences. For coffee of Leave Me Alone, J.J. Johnson, we already got Claude Debussy, Debussy, I will not say what I'm thinking, this white, hot, oh, it's hot dog, but it's in the red. This French composer, sometimes considered the first Impressionist composer, rebelled against classical forms of compositions and strove to create new modes, sometimes based off his own poetry. What do you mean, don't? Oh, haha. <laughs> Richard Strauss. This leading German composer of operas and symphonic poems was arguably best known for the piece also Spoch... Nope, we're not even doing it. I can't do German today. My throat's already destroyed. Whether or not he ate hot dogs is unknown. I'm gonna guess no. Yeah, I- oh, I saw. I saw the red letters with the hot- I got it. The patty emote. Oh, okay. Can I- can I go to the baboons yet? not strong enough to open the baboon door. I don't even know what the baboon door does. Wow, I love the room. I don't think I can open this yet. Build card? Turd card? What? 
Oh, is it? Wait, is that what you do with your, like... Hold on, I have four Prokofievs. So if I... Turn all the dupes... Oh, it's literal. Oh, it's too late. What do you do with them? <laughs> Greetings, noble tromboner. Thank you for summoning me. I didn't want to. My name is, well, maybe some things are best kept secret for now. I'll assume you summoned me on purpose and weren't just mindlessly kicking, clicking the chaos candle. I was mindlessly clicking the chaos candle. Well, what say you, noble tromboner? Say greetings, let's be polite. Only an inquisitive soul would find me here. Do you seek to become the trombone champ? Uh, I, yeah, I guess. Buddy, do you even really know what the trombone champ is? N no. Well, you will in time. Yes, the baboons will show you the way. I can help you become the trombone champ, but I need magic to do so, and my magic requires sacrificing tromboner cards. Why does magic require you to sacrifice tromboner cards, you ask? It's best not to ask questions like this. Just go with the flow. So will you help me? Sure. I currently require one music, one baboon, and one Richie ass. Can you give me these cards? No. That's disappointing. You change your mind, summon me again. This card has a weird devil symbol on it. Oh, wait, I can build it. I wish I hadn't, as it turns out. Oh, it's the baboon. Yeah, I think it's just the card I need. So if I give him the cards now... Why not? It's gonna perform magics. Okay, oh. Oh dear, okay. W what? Oh? I don't know! Well, at least Cookie Clicker prepared me for this shit. And now we have a silver trombone. Okay. Okay. I don't understand what just happened.